Today we will study from the book Masnad Imam Ahmad. Read this hadith three five four, Mr. Abdul Razak. Okay. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. It was narrated from Ibn Umar, from his father, that the Prophet wasallam said, the deceased is tormented in his grief because of being willed over. Al-Hajjaj said, because of the willing of him. Hmm. So here we need to write the question. What happens to the deceased when his family will our his dead body? What happens to the deceased, the dead person, when his family will over his dead body? So in the answer you will write according to the hadith 354 of masnad imam Ahmad. He is tormented in his grave. He is tormented in his grave. He is tormented in his grave. So now, <clears throat> Rukiya, do you hear us? Yes, I can hear you. Okay, repeat the question and the answer. What happened to the deceased when his family wail over him? Mm. And he will be tormented in his grave. What is the hadith number? Oh, I forgot. Sorry. Did not you write the answer? Today is my first time to join the class. Okay, no problem. Next time, try to bring the <laughs> notebook as well, okay? I will. Thank you. Now, read this hadith. It was narrated that Katada said, I had Rufai Abu Ali and narrated from Ibn Abbas. A man told me, Shub. Shuba said, I think he said, one of the companions of the Prophet وسلم, the most admired of them to me is Umar bin al Qatab. The Messenger of Allah وسلم, forbade praying at two times after Asr until the sun sets and after Fajr until the sun rises. Mm, so here we will write the question. Can you pray any 
نوافل نوافل صلاة which is optional صلاة نوافل mean optional صلاة voluntary صلاة can you pray any نوافل after اثر صلاة the word here is اثر So in the answer, you will write according to Hadith 355. No, you cannot pray Nawafil until the sun sets. I will repeat the answer. According to Hadith uh -huh. 355, no, you cannot pray the Nawafil until the sun sets. Then you will write the, another similar question. Can you pray any Nawafil Salah after the Fajr Salah? Can you pray? Any Nawafil Salah after the Fajr Salah. So in the answer you will write According to Hadith 355, no, you cannot pray Nawafil after Fajr until the sun rises. No, you cannot pray Nawafil after Fajr until the sun rises. Mr. Abdul Razak, repeat the questions and the answers. Okay. So, question number one What happens to the deceased when his family will over him? So, according to Hadith number at this number 354 in Musnad Ahmed, um, the disease is tormented when the family will at him. Next question I am saying the can you pray any Nawafil after Asasla? This question. Okay. So, according to Hadith number 355, no, it is not permissible to pray any nafla after uh, after to the sunrise and after Adil as well. Okay. Do you remember the Hadith number? Without yes. Yes. Please come again. Do you remember the Hadith number? Yes, I know the Hadith number. Okay, tell me. So, uh, it's Hadith number 355. Mm -hmm. What do you want? Bye. In um, uh, uh, Musnad Ahmed. Okay.
Okay, next read uh, this one. Um, please, are you referring to me? Yes. Okay. So, uh, this is number 356. It was narrated by Katada. It was narrated that Katada said, I had Abu Uthman and Nahdi say, the letter of Umar came to us when we were in uh, Azerbaijan with Utbah bin Farqad or in Syria, saying, the Messenger of Allah forbid silk except so much, two fingers. Abu Uthman said, we had no doubt that he meant sick borders. Okay, so here we will write the question. Again, the men wear silk clothes. Again, the men wear silk clothes. So in the answer, you will write, according to Hadith, The answer you would write according to Hadith 356. No, they cannot wear silk clothes. But they can use very small amount of silk for designing on the clothes. So according to Hadith, Three, five, six. No, they cannot wear silk clothes, but they can use very little amount of silk for designing on the clothes. Miss Rukaya, repeat the question and the answer. Can the men wear silk clothes? No, they cannot wear silk clothes, but they can use small amount of silk when designing the clothes. Okay. Now we we'll write the question. Okay. Now read this one. This at this. It was narrated that. Amir bin Maimun said, Omar radiallahu anhu prayed Fajr when he was in Jam. Abu Daud said, we were with Omar in Jam. And he said, the Mushrikun used not to move on until the sun rose. And they will say, shine, Mount Thabir, the Prophet of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, differed from them and moved on before the sun rose. This hadith is related to the Hajj. So when there's a ritual there, 
non muslim mushrikeens before islam in the pre islamic period of ignorance they used not to move until the sun rose but the muslims prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam used to move at that place before sun rose so this is needed in the hajj not now no need to write any question next student Abdul Razak. Yeah. Read this one. Um, okay. Um, um, it was narrated by Abdullah bin Dinar said. Sorry, it was narrated that Abdullah bin Dinar said, I heard Ibn Umar say, Umar asked the messenger of Allah, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, if I become Junub at night, what should I do? He said, wash your private parts, then do, do, then go to sleep. So this thing is not necessary, but it is recommended. So of often, husband and wife intimate at night and until the Fajr Salah, there is a plenty of time left. So what is recommended to husband and wife if they want to delay delay the bath of Janaba until the Fajr Salah. What is recommended to the husband and wife? If they want to delay the bath of Janaba, I will repeat what is recommended to the husband and wife if they want to delay the bath of Janaba until the Fajr Salah. In the answer you will write, they better walk. In the answer you will write, according to Hadith 359 of Masnad Imam Ahmad, they better wash their private part and make wudu. Assalamu alaikum. Do you hear me now? Wa alaikum salam. Yeah, I can hear you. Okay. Did you hear the answer or shall I repeat it? Come again. Did you hear the answer or shall, shall I repeat it? Yeah, I've heard the answer. Okay, tell me the repeat the question and the answer. So what is recommended to a husband and wife if they want to delay the birth of Janaba Salah? So according to the hadith um, number 359 in Muslim Ahmad, um, it, it, they, um, it is recommended for them to perform wudu and go to sleep. It is recommended to them to wash the private part and make wudu. First thing is wash yes. your private part and then make the wudu. Thank you.
نیکسٹ اسٹوڈنٹ ختیجہ مسلم ریڈ دس اوکے اس واز نریٹڈ دا سن بون کوہیل سیڈ ہائی ہیڈ عبد عبد الحق عبد الحکم سیڈ ہائی اک I asked Ibn Umar about having with jaws and inherited to us from where is it? And inherited, inherited to us from Umar Allah, Allah, that the Prophet of Allah forbid making Nabid making Nabid in Ethin, Ethin with jaws, clouds and finished jaws. So Nabiz is a kind of drink that they used to make at that time. So Prophet Sallallahu forbade to make that drink in these specific utensils. So, no need to write any question. Ms. Rukaya. Naam. Read it. It was narrated that Abdullah bin Sarji said, I saw the bald one, meaning Omar bin Al-Qatab, Radiallahu anhum kissing the black stone and saying, I know that you are only a stone, but I saw the messenger of Allah, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, kiss you. So here we will. So we kiss the black stone in Kaaba only because the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam kissed it. So whatever Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam did, we try to follow it so there is no other thing in that stone we just kiss him only because prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam kissed that black stone so that was all for today if anybody has any question they can ask me now then we will stop the class the first question i came to the class late so the first question what is the answer what happens to the deceased when his family wells over him? So the deceased is tormented in the grave when his family wail over him. So wailing means shouting aloud, crying in a loud voice. Normal crying, no problem. But when they wail, the deceased is tormented in the grave anybody else which book, which, which book did are we treating right now sorry which book are we treating what is the name of the book masnade imam ahmad okay Anybody else? Imam Ahmad. Yes. See you all next time, inshallah. Ma'as salam.